Hi everybody, and welcome to Skidmore College. My name is Kelby Wittenberg, and I will be your guide for today's tour. We're standing right now in Case Green, the center of academic, social, and residential space here at Skidmore College. This green is surrounded by the student center, the library, several residence halls, and behind me, the dining hall. The green is a great place to relax outdoors with friends and also hosts some iconic Skidmore events every single year, such as our very popular Fall Club Fair. The Murray Aikens Dining Hall is one of Skidmore's most beloved and iconic buildings, and for very good reason. Inside, you can find food from all over the world for every dietary preference and restriction. Behind me is the Billy Tisch Center for Integrated Sciences, or CIS for short. The CIS represents the single largest building initiative in the college's history and creates a hub that connects academic departments from across campus. CIS is where you'll find computer science, environmental studies and sciences, math, chemistry, biology, and Skidmore's other science programs. But what makes it unique is how many different students study and work here. You'll find French majors using the 3D printer in our makerspace and idea lab, health sciences majors in the greenhouse, and anyone who wants to understand our world better reserving time in our microscopy lab, a collection of microscopes that rivals what you'll find at top research institutions. Powell Mountain Hall is home to a number of academic departments, including business, English, education, and world languages. The majority of Skidmore's classes are held here and in neighboring buildings like the Tisch Learning Center and Ladd and Bolton Hall. The average class size is 16 students, and that small size, along with our 8 to 1 faculty ratio, are hallmarks of the Skidmore experience. In fact, many alumni share that our small community and close relationships with professors were the best parts of their time here. The Arthur Zankow Music Center is Skidmore's hub of musical activity. This building is home to our music department and features a variety of spaces for teaching, practice, and performance. Zankow is both a public concert venue and an educational space open to everyone, whether you plan to study music, want to take lessons, or enjoy singing or playing as a hobby. The center is also home to the Helen Feinlein Ladd Concert Hall, an acoustically tuned, award-winning, 600-seat performance venue. Here you can take part in a variety of campus and community events, catch student concerts like our brass, string, and jazz ensembles, or have a great seat for performances by Grammy-winning artists. The Janet Kinghorn Bernard Theater, JKB to us, is home to our theater department. The department puts on multiple shows each semester that are fully student produced and often feature a mix of majors and non-majors as actors, technicians, designers, and more. The Saslin Art Center is home to a wide range of studio art classes from printmaking and fiber arts to drawing and sculpture among many others. The Schick Art Gallery is also located here and highlights work from students, faculty, and other artists. The Case Student Center is often described as the heart of campus as it's visited by students and professors alike. It's a great place to meet up with friends, grab a coffee at Burgess Cafe, or grab a quick bite to eat at the spa. If you're looking to gear up with the latest Skidmore apparel and swag, you can head to the Skidmore shop on the first floor of Case, which also doubles as our campus's bookstore. Case Center is also home to our student government and several other important offices, including the Office of Campus Life and Engagement and our Student Wellness Center. In the fall of 2021, Skidmore opened Wyckoff Center, an expansive working and event space meant to foster conversations around diversity, equity, inclusion, and social justice. Mm -hmm. 
Welcome to the Lucy Scribner Library, where many students, including myself, come to work, do research, or just enjoy themselves. The library is four stories tall, with the third floor notably being the quiet floor for those who wish to work in a distraction-free environment. There are many great places to work here, like by the large bay windows or in the quiet study rooms upstairs. Throughout the library, you can find PC and Mac workstations, along with free printing on the first floor. The Williamson Sports Center Complex is home to Skidmore Athletics, the Department of Dance, and campus fitness facilities, including weight rooms, pool, racquetball courts, aerobics and fitness areas, locker rooms, and gyms. Skidmore is an NCAA Division III school and a founding member of the Liberty League. The college supports 19 varsity sports plus a number of club and intramural programs. Adjacent to the sports center are dedicated turf fields for softball and field hockey, nine tennis courts, an all-weather track, and a lighted turf field for soccer and lacrosse in front of stadium seating for 1,400 spectators. If you're a sports fan, you can't miss the Big Green Scream, an annual tradition held each winter where our men's and women's basketball teams have back-to-back -back home games and tons of Skidmore students and faculty come out to support them, decked out in green and yellow. Residential life at Skidmore is a tight-knit community that truly feels like your home away from home. More than 90% of students choose to live here on campus because being here is so central to the Skidmore experience. As a first year student, you will either live in a triple or double room in one of our residence halls and all of the rooms are suite style, meaning you share a bathroom with only four to eight other students. Once you reach junior or senior year, you can apply to live in our highly sought after on campus apartments. No matter where you live, you're never far from the heart of campus or the other important aspects of student life at Skidmore, including our on campus counseling center, health services, wellness center, and more. With its prominent location and distinctive architecture, the Tang Teaching Museum and Art Gallery is one of the most recognizable buildings on campus. As a public contemporary art museum, the Tang gets about 40,000 visitors a year and features several rotating art exhibits at one time. Everything here is about interdisciplinary learning and finding ways to use the arts as a medium for engaging in conversations about climate change, equity, social justice, and the overall richness of the human experience. It also is a common place for internships, research, and events like the annual Tang Party and regular student-led tours. And that's a wrap. It's truly impossible to recap all there is to see and do at Skidmore, but I hope I was able to give you a preview of what it's like to live and study here. Personally, I love that I've been able to find communities as both a student and an athlete, but I'm confident you could find your place here too.